That ball, that ball, that ball. Both pairs should go half on 120 to 130 grain, which is roughly about 60 to 65,000 feet. So you average that out over 18 years, you know what I'm saying? That's, and I think that's fair. No matter who your child is, no matter. If you got an NFL child, you got a child by Jay Z or somebody like that, it don't matter. All your child needs is 135 dollars from the age zero to the age of 18. That's all I'm saying. Anything extra outside of that? What if I think my child most special than your child? Then you going off of your thoughts. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing wrong with your thinking, but thinking. When you look up things, I look up how much it costs to raise a child from zero to 18. I ain't look up what Kiki was thinking or what Quantilla was thinking or what, you know. When you look at it, I look up how much it takes to raise a child. So, one of my people said they were behind $90,000 in the child. God damn. And they don't, and they don't take with 120000 30,000 rats. Yeah. Right. God damn. So, right there alone, even if he already been paying, he behind three fourths of, of what the, Where they gonna take the, the right. tape. You know what I'm saying? To, yeah, that's some bullshit. So, we're gonna say three fourths of, of uh, 18 years old is. What that about? 13 and a half years of age, that's it. Why? He don't pay for all that for us. By himself. So what you think about goddamn, what you think about goddamn, let's say for instance, you fuck with a bride, and hey, goddamn, she get pregnant, and she wanna have an abortion. But you don't want to have a boy. Y'all been kicking it, spending money. You been spending money on it. Y'all been spending time, and then she have an abortion, and you and you don't want no abortion. Well, I ain't through yet. And and think about the same scenario, but the man want an abortion, and the woman want to keep the child. Which and the woman said, "She did my body. I'm gonna have an abortion if you want to keep it, and I'm gonna keep it if you want an abortion." Right? right. So what you think about it? if if she kill it, if she kill it before goddamn before because the man didn't want it. I mean the man wanted it. Right. And then if she keep it and the man don't want it, like a nigga who might got an old lady and he cheat. Right. But they said, look, I don't want the goddamn. I don't try. To, I pay you to goddamn go get it and the bride keep the baby. What you think she should? What you think should be the outcome of that? Well, I think like this. On both of those scenarios. On both of those scenarios, I think like this. If the man want to keep the baby and the female don't want to keep the baby, I think the bottom line is going to come down to if she really want to keep the baby or not because it is somebody. But it's your nut. You created the baby. I understand. That. And you're going to have to take care of the baby. Hold on. Let, me finish, let me finish my whole thought process. Okay. <clears throat> she gonna, if she want to have an abortion, that's what she going to want. That's what probably going to end up happening. Nine times out of ten. Because that's her baby. Right. If she don't want the baby, that's what she going to end up doing. Right. Now, flip the, flip the strip. Saying like, if I don't want the baby and she want to keep the baby, right? Mm -hmm. it's nine times out of ten, here we go again. She gonna probably do what she want to do. <clears throat> she gonna end up keeping the baby, right? But on both scenarios, it's up to her. It's up to her. But at the same time, if I explain to her that I ain't want no child and she go ahead and have a baby anyway, then she chose to take care of that baby by herself. Yeah. I didn't choose to help take care of that baby. I didn't choose to be that baby father. None of that at that point in time. Right. She chose that by herself. I ain't had no say so in the matter. <clears throat> so don't come and ask me about no say so in the matter and no other. Right. She, so she got to say so in the matter if she not if right. she murked the little motherfucker. Right. She had to she had to say so in right. that part. Yeah. 
So it's your, it's your responsibility because they my body. Right. Right. They my responsibility. At that point in time. All right, then. All, all the right. decisions follow on her. So what you think about the bride who had a baby, and then when she had a baby, and the nigga ain't want the baby, then she put the nigga up for child support? Yeah, what I'm saying. If the guy did not want to have a baby in the first place, it shouldn't be allowed to be put on child support. Right. So if you, if this America, you think they should have wrote a contract out? Like he wrote down, I don't, I'm not agreeing to this pregnancy. Right. She agreeing to I'm it. Not even, and then both of y'all sign I'm not even notarized. What if I say, what if I explain to her, I'm not even financially stable enough to even raise a child? Yeah. Bring a kid in the world right now. So I'm trying to prevent this from happening. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to keep both of us, you know, focused on what's going on. I'm not able to hardly take care of myself. So, you know, it's a mistake. So listen, it's an easy way to undo this. You know what I'm saying? But if you want to go forth and go ahead and have a baby anyway after that, it's your responsibility. Yeah, so you law, understand what's going on. Right. At this point in time, you already thought, thought this through. You already know what's going on for 18 years. Yeah. You know you... It take 120, 30,000. You already know this. Hey, but at the same time, too, though, check this out. What if she have her baby and go ahead on and say, look, I don't really don't need you anyway. I'm straight. You know what I'm saying? I got yeah. my career going. You know what I'm saying? I'm able to raise... Hell, three kids, really. You know what I'm saying? I make, you know what I'm saying, three hundred and eighty thousand dollars a year. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So what does she feel like? I really don't need you nowhere. I don't need no assistance, and I don't need well, nothing. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Then your child come up to be something. I had a motherfucker. Hey, man. Your child come on to yeah. be like a Shaquille O'Neal or yeah, LeBron. Right. But well, who LeBron dad is? Right. You know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. I know. Who Shaq real dad is? Yeah, he know who real dad. Is. But who is it? I don't know that nigga. Now. I know Phil. Do you know the the one that was in the army? Yeah, Phil. The Phil. one that yeah. really took care of him. You know yeah, what I mean? His father by law that would have fought in the big snare. That the dead beat motherfucker probably be wishing though. God damn, I should have been a part of my child's life. I should have wanted. You know what I mean? You gotta be that old kid. Oh yeah, most definitely. But see, okay, you what, what you think more important than goddamn time or money? Definitely the time, because as a child, they don't understand no money. Right, attention. Right. Attention. Definitely got to spend time with Shit, we What if you got children have, in a different state? Say that again? What if you have children in a different state? You know what I'm saying? You got to make time for all of them. You got to make time. You got to get up there. They got to come if, down here too, though. What if the mama don't want, what if the mama be tripping? She got down, let you see him whenever she feels. See, that's that shit I be talking about right now. Uh, what if the mama don't want him to come down it here? It shouldn't even have nothing to do with the mama. But by law, bro, I read that the, uh, the child's poke If book, you want to spend time with your child, bro. The yeah. mama is the legal guardian, right? Yeah. You're not married to him, your child is considered an illegitimate child. They're a bastard. You feel what I'm saying? You a non custodial parent. So, if you ain't married to it, the only other way to really got there be able to get some shit going if you get on child support, like some in the system where the bride say, oh yeah, this is child. <coughs> and then when they tell you, you got to get the child legitimized like it's a motherfucking a, a dog or something. It's you know a fact for you to pay for your child but not be able to see your child and spend time with him. Hell nah. But it's her child by law. She, she, it's she, a fact for you to pay for your child and not spend time with him. If you want to, you know what I'm saying? You want to spend, that's, that's, that's dumb shit. That, you want to spend. See, that I went by shit. Motherfucker kept my, man, listen, man. Motherfucker kept. Yeah, that's a personal shit, but I don't give a damn. Motherfucker kept my children away from me for like a year and some change one time. You feel me? I don't supposed to feel about that. What I supposed to do? You know what I'm saying? That's serious, though. Yeah. And they still want their money, though. They still got to eat. They still got to get down, go to school, they still need, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's a hell of a lot of hustle. But my thing is, if 
We don't both agree on this shit. It's no deal. That's America, ain't it? Man. You know what I'm saying? But, bro, I'm the type of nigga, I don't believe in abortions and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? So, shit, we both know we raw dog. And doing all the shit we doing. Yeah. You feel We knew this before. We knew, you know the consequences of shit before they like nigga hussy. Nigga, you, you know, know what she living? Huh? You know what she think? What she think? I said, you know what she stayed. Who? Yeah. Baby mama. Yeah. More well, that, man. Yeah, no. I'm gonna fuck with you. I'm gonna fuck with you. That shit was years ago, man. My children got down up. Shit. I told her older, you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, they had got down. They called daddy directly. Direct the pie. You feel? Yeah. Then they got that new shit out. They called Cash Out. Yeah. Hey, I'm gonna fuck around like that. Yeah. I got that. Ain't fuck around on that. You know what I'm saying? I stay off of all social media, on sites like on YouTube and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't fuck around, I don't want shit. Hell, like, hey, I be on Instagram, got them promote my uh, little businesses and shit. Oh, yeah. The work I be doing, the butt naked money, motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And that podcast shit, you know, that, that part podcast, what we doing. Oh, yeah. That's what we doing. But you know what I'm saying? I just try to stay out of the way, you know what I'm saying? I'm a real, so what you what you feel I'm about a private motherfucker? What, you know what I'm saying? Like, <clears throat> really? Now that's a whole different goddamn thing right there, though. Like, how I think about it, social media can be goddamn fucked up and messy, and yeah, sometimes you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. What you think about Donald Trump saying that he be the president? He gonna make drug dealers get the death penalty. First of all. That's a non-violent crime. How can you ever give somebody a death penalty for a non-violent crime? China do it, but it, China ain't... This ain't China. Yeah. We're talking about America. This America. Yeah, you want to discuss China, then let's discuss China. But right. this is America right now, what we're talking about. Man, what the fuck that nigga got going on, man? He was no, cool that first time. Yeah, he was cool that first time. That nigga lying. I fuck with the pimp on that first time, but... Um, he talking lying, no. Yeah, you can't be saying no shit like that. That just out of bounds right there. Because that's a non-violent crime. <clears throat> for one thing, and yeah. they ain't never about no motherfucking children get abducted and raped and all that type of shit. Sometimes, them, sometimes you do what you gotta thing. do to get where you need to go, and then you just say fuck that shit once you get there. For instance, I know a uh, female that went to truck driving school, and they paid for her uh, CDLs and everything because she signed a contract saying she was going to drive for them for a certain amount of time, you know what I'm saying, for like a year or something, or yeah. more, to pay for her school and all that. But as soon as she got her CDL, she uh, dipped on them folks and went and drove for her uh, down self, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> and and got them got her own shit and they ain't got, nobody never said nothing about that. So what I'm saying is, <clears throat> Trump could be just using that Vehicle to get to where he trying to go, and then flip the script. And then flip the end. script. He probably really don't mean that type of shit. But you gotta say a certain type of shit to get to where you going. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Especially if you finna bamboozle a nigga. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Which is what they do in it. Say whoop whoop your ass. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So Trump, I don't believe you. I don't even believe you think like that. Cause you believe in goddamn. Really, all you wanna do is get some money. I already know what you want to do. Chunk don't want that much of money. Yeah, that's all he wants. Yeah. Paper. He want that paper. Exactly. Yeah. If you talk about money, he, he got down this. You know what I'm saying? And I like what Trump like the first, got. But when I heard the shit, I'm like, man, that nigga ain't saying nothing about no rape. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, you ought to be, man, murderers and shit like that. Man, what the fuck? This is not the way. You feel me? So, yeah, man. You having problems with a leaf takeover? grass looking all shabby and you want to get that yard winterized say less and call the best dirty south landscaping they will clean you up and get you right call big wayne at dirty south landscaping 478-283-8708 that's 478-283-8708 What you think about the crime that's going on, period, like, 
going on like in Atlanta, you know, Macon and everywhere like that, you know. <clears throat> in every city though, it's really the same shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's, it's the same shit in every hood, in every city. Yeah. Uh, what it seems like these kids these days just doing it wrong to be. You know what I'm saying? I feel what you're saying. Okay, then I'm going to say this then, because we got them kids and got them. Somebody gave, gave us some attention, right? And. We had our papa around. We had our papa. We had our dad. Yeah. yeah. For a certain male figure that we looked up to and respected. See, now, nigga, the goddamn motherfucking, your, your goddamn little child playing, your, your baby mama got your son, and then he played football, and goddamn, she she wearing them tight with that pussy print, Sean. You feel me? Coach, you know, the little boy waking up, see, coach, and Walking out the room with mom. You feel me? So he, res he respect for him decreased. Like, damn, man, he just came out my mama room. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, motherfuckers be looking at certain the figures that they had respect for at first, and then they turn around and see the figure and see how they, a nigga or some bullshit, and then they think everybody's some bullshit. So now they just learn from mama and then they partner when they go outside and do some more drama ass shit. Cause it's, man, they do this. We all yarn now. We all did some crazy shit, doing our team and shit. So you, you know don't think these uh, these new grapples got nothing to do with like uh uh these new rappers these days talk about taking so many different drugs from when we were coming up. You know, the only thing we want to do is smoke up some gas and goddamn, you know what I'm saying, drink us. Okay, up. and we ain't talking about killing, motherfucker talking about killing. I mean, we were going out there just killing motherfuckers. You feel me? Nigga, what Charles Barkley said, nigga, I am not your role model. Right. Your parents should be your role model. Right. I looked up to my daddy growing up. You feel what I'm saying? I know you looked up to your daddy growing up. You feel what I'm saying? So, but, 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 even then, even at that, nigga, nigga, when we were coming up, did we, did we want to do what we seen the rapper doing? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, to a certain extent. To a certain extent. When you see, that was like, common sense come in play too. Man. I remember them boys from uh, New York used to wear them big ropes. Yeah. Them big gold chains. You know what I'm saying? Like right there on see them back in the day. Nigga, that's the first thing we used to go do. Go get us a rope. Yeah. Or do, do what they doing. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, they, oh, they had Adidas and Shell Toes, Adidas and shit like that. Then they came out with the fat boy shoe strings and all that shit. Yeah, no shoe strings. Yeah, no shoe strings. And whatever they do, whatever they do on TV, they were high tech boot. Right. But you ain't see Easy E them, Run them C, or none of them niggas talking about going to goddamn Pops and Percocets and, and, and two Adderalls and goddamn. Oh, yes. Nah, they were not talking about being OJ. Right. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So once you start taking out, putting all that shit in a play these days, these new days. We grew up, we grew up like the one, the uh, dealer with the one and the user with the loser. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. Yeah. That's what yeah, I'm saying. That's still what it is, though. But do, okay, do that take effect on the crime today, though? Because these dudes, these kids today, doing what these rappers Man, doing today, these niggas out there mind. Man, it ain't the children's fault, bro. A child, man, is it a child teach? They said they're gonna do some bullshit, bro. Where the fuck your parent at, man? Where the fuck your uncle, your grandma, and you? Could be cousin. Like, man, it's a family. The they same thing. They did right the goddamn right children, move. bro. The same thing. They did right the children, bro. We can't just blame them on the motherfucking children because I was yeah. goddamn wild on, young time out, listen. My damn self. But listen, though, they're in the same saying? place. Yeah, they ain't do with my grandma and them because my grandma the, and them taught me. They're in the same place, dude. You said God gave you, boy. They was when we came up. We did the same shit when we see on TV. I just said that we want them D the outfit and yeah. all nah, that shit. We want them to our rapper that promote that, but yeah. our rapper promote it. Selling drugs and killing, and look how yeah. many niggas in prison for doing that shit. Li really listening to them niggas, not paying attention that them niggas were character. Them niggas had a goddamn a movie script name, goddamn Dr. Dre. That ain't real motherfucking name. Hell you feel nah. what I'm saying? Uh, Easy E. That nigga real name what, what Eric Wright. But that's where the E come from, and that's where the Dre come from. D O C. Andre. Ice Cube. Them 
nigga, man, come on, bro. This there Washington was Alonzo and motherfucking goddamn uh, train today. This ain't watching a bit of loud shit. Yeah, yeah, I'm just saying though, bro. That was character. Niggas ain't trying to be alone though. Who you know though, Jordan? Trying to Jordan for? But we yeah. trying to be a rapper though. We trying to be like so that you're following it. You're so. That what they is. <coughs> that what everybody. You is. know what the word in the street is, man. That what everybody do though. You everybody gotta, see something another nigga do, and then be like, okay, man, that guy let a, shit. You let a sucker get lit, man. If they go through that, man, so what? That's what it is, bro. I ain't even sure really, no You can really call it this. You can really call it uh, street learning or, or, or adapting to your environment if that's what you're around. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you see that you like, that's what you're going to do after. You know what I'm saying? That's what you're going to say. Look, this nigga always oh, got them having Because you you'll see a nigga who, who, who doing good on the street. And say this nigga, oh, we got the bad hoes, the bad bitches, and this, that, and the third. And you try to say, shit, that's what I'm finna do too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So, so, so they still learn and shit, they learn behavior. They learn, they learn, learn behavior. Said, nigga, you probably learn from your goddamn parents and not a motherfucker on the outside. Bro. Yeah, but see. So it's not the children's fault, they fucking parents' fault, boy. Bro, you feel me? It's not the children's fault, bro. We can't blame them got young folk for shit, bro. And most of them doing shit because they hungry, my nigga. Period, bro. My folks doing shit because they hungry. The big ass on the eat, they know they can go home. You can go outside and play, goddammit. You can go outside and play. And then you got them go hoop and all that shit. Then you come home, you about to tell you, I'm go home and make me a sandwich. You feel what I'm saying? It's different when the motherfucker, he hooping. You feel me? They probably ain't got no tissue in the house or shit. Yeah. They did a little bad or something to eat in the house. So, nigga, his mind said different from yours. Check this out, though. Do, do what, do what it makes go you. back to the parent, bro. Yeah. yeah. It go back to <coughs> a nigga trying to get some money, really, and try to do what he's seen another nigga do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because you can see a nigga... For instance, you see little baby them riding around the scat pads and... With big, big four pocket full, big diamonds on and all this shit. So what these niggas gonna wanna do is, that's the hottest shit, cause little baby be with some bad hoes on their videos and all this type of shit. So what these niggas wanna do is go get them hell cat scat pack with big pockets like they four pockets full too. And big diamonds and all this shit, cause they wanna do what this nigga do. You know what I'm saying? Look, let me tell you this. One time my cousin told me this shit here. He said, man, I flew to Miami, did more than me and that little bitch. You know what I mean? I just took her down there right fast, just to knock her off right fast. You know what I'm saying? He yeah. took her down there, they went shopping and shit down in Miami, but he flew right there. They ain't stay that long down there. He just, him and her just, he met her at the airport, he paid for both of their tickets around trip to Miami right fast. He flew down there, they kicked it down there for, the, for that couple of hours, a few hours and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? They came on back to Atlanta. Nigga ain't never know that nigga went to Miami that day. Yeah. You know what I mean? This nigga don't went to Miami all and been down now. And a nigga don't even know that nigga been out of Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? So I said, God damn, that's some balling ass shit right there. You what you just did? You know yeah. what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Cause your goddamn your folk don't know you ain't been gone. You know what I'm saying? This nigga done been all the way in Miami. Nigga don't even know. That yeah, motivated you to want to do that shit too. How can I do that type shit right now? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? How that can ego. I... Yeah, exactly. Ego. So I'll be like, shit, how the heck can I call it? And then everything just... really like, this ain't for instant, bro. A motherfucker have a goal. You know what I'm saying? And then you accomplish the goal. Nigga, once you accomplish the goal, it like, nah. You know what I'm saying? Then you gotta go try to do something, man. All this shit like adrenaline rush. Shit that, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. get busting the net. Adrenaline rush. So let me tell you this, though. Driving fast. The add you know on to saying? that story, like, though. Ego, that's your mind, really. Let me tell you this, the add on to that story, though. What I'm trying to do now is. What I'm trying to do now? Get some paper. How I'm trying to do it. Yeah, fast. Yeah, fast. Right, fast, right? Yeah. How fast can I go? Yeah. Ain't no, ain't Here we go, ain't no though. Limit. Here we go, though. I'm trying to do what this nigga did. God damn, man. You know what I'm saying? Really, 
Nigga ain't gonna really need to see all that kind of shit, man. Nigga yeah. really need to see some. Man, that shit'll turn a nigga on right there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That kind of living, that kind of lifestyle right there, hell yeah, that's how a nigga wanna live. <laughs> that's a motherfucker ego talking to you. Yeah. Damn yeah, right. But well, everything come behind it though. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of shit come behind that shit, bro. Alright, if a nigga get bapped up, it's, it, that, if you, if that bro, you went and got that, spot that money on, you went to Miami, this you got that, put some on your books. That bring violence, though. You feel what I'm saying? Like, do that shit come with violence? Hell yeah. Man, this, man, but in the days, two ways, in, in my two, I was two shits in life, bro, as a human being, bro. You got a passion and a purpose, my nigga. Period, bro. One on goddamn, yeah. oh yeah, nigga, I like the goddamn rap, bro. I like the, <laughs> Hoop, or I like to play Let football. Let me take it in. Do you think the type bro. of weapons is different today than it was back then? Nah, weapons are weapon. Shit, them folks. A 22 bullet of keys, just like a goddamn okay. AK bullet. I don't know if you right. remember. You might do remember. He hit this. your ass. I don't know, I don't know if you it. remember down by law. Listen, I don't know if you, you don't know if you remember that um, group down by law. That gang back then. Listen, that, bro. Them nigga back then was not using. Glocks with switches, with extended clips and shit like that. That's all I'm saying. So it wasn't no motherfucker, man. It wasn't no chopper back then. Fucking crazy. I think we use an Uzi. And they had AR-15. Man, listen, bro, you gotta, see, you gotta go back. You gotta go back then, then. Nigga, nigga, nigga man, gangsta, you had an Uzi. Now that motherfucker was jamming like a motherfucker. Them niggas started getting them real guns, man. Niggas was out in the street for real. My nigga wasn't running around with no goddamn AK-47. I'm hell mouth. Man, them niggas have an AK-47. Now one of them niggas wasn't running around with no yeah. AK-47. Period. Or yeah. no goddamn AR-15. Or no Meta-14. Or none of that kind of shit. No two two three. None of that shit. Most birds. That right. That was that weapon of choice, but them guns existed during those years. It was a few niggas had them. Yeah. But them guns existed in the year, man. Yeah, man, them niggas had some. I remember goddamn, my, my, uh, my folk don't have a room. Some 357 revolvers and shit like that. But that player though, like them niggas, man, come on, bro. Just think about how many of them niggas that got away with shit with them type shit. See, everybody who's shooting these type of gun, they going to jail and they hear the innocent bystander. Them niggas shooting close now. They got them go crazy, like, you know what I'm saying? Don't even know how to hold a gun or none of that shit, bro. They, they, you feel me? A switch. No, I'm saying, got a switch I'm on. saying the never- You hit that bitch, that bitch. And then you know they don't know how to shoot. Where you practicing it? If you grew up in the meadow, if you grew up in man. Where the fuck you practicing it? Yeah, but you know how to shoot the goddamn gun. You, your practice is a human being. Shooting at other niggas. Yeah, I'm saying so you yeah. might miss this nigga. Hold on, time out. That's what I'm saying. You grew up in the meadow, but if you behind them bricks, though, nine times out of ten, there's some shit happening out there in the horseshoe or something like that. Shit, you was safe in the house, but. Today, even if you were back then in the meadow, just say you bring them same part mates today, nigga, your ass can be in there behind them bricks all you want to, nigga. I'm sending some shit straight through them bricks. Today, we got shit going through them bricks like that ain't shit. I don't got shot of a bitch, don't got hit. Yeah, okay. but I know some folks, like I said, I know a girl that it don't matter what Ellen. kind of bullet. Listen, if that bitch make it to the target, it could be a little bitty bullet. If man, I know a girl. To the target, it, it, it do, a it girl in Etheridge, a goddamn B building. A gun can't shoot a shit bag up. right now. Here, cause them niggas out there parking like shooting. Shoot. Like shoot. Without no human being assisting, a human being assisting in them guns, bro. Here, bro. Yeah, but back then okay. though, we wasn't goddamn really killing all all these folk like that. We were, but we wasn't. Man, these niggas hating they say they hating their daddies. They mad at their daddies. Cause their mama ran the daddies off and then he, she had, he had four, five, six, seven step daddies and ain't none of them niggas showing no love. They go out and throw the football with them, teach them how to goddamn uh, fix a tie. Them you feel what I'm saying? Like, bro, this shit, bro, this Sitting shit. Sitting on the sunroof. This shit, man, it, motherfucker, it's too emotional. Acting girly, man. Fuck out of this shit, bro. Who gonna say what it is? Nigga, goddamn, you can't take no criticism, nigga. You feel me? Uh, none of that shit, nigga. You sensitive. You calling your girl, bro? What nigga call a girl, hey, bro? Nigga, what? Twin, twin, man. What the fuck, bro? Nigga, I girl, hey, baby. You know what I'm saying? Hey, shit. Maybe girl, your girl, baby. maybe that nigga girl acting like a, a nigga. Well, she. Maybe man, she wasn't paying. 
Man, ain't no such thing. Come on, man. Yeah, I mean, a boy is a boy and a girl. Um, it's called male and female. Yeah. You, you ain't never heard the, uh, the great late uh, Kevin Samuel say, uh, put your dick up. Put your dick up. Yeah. See, them masculine bro. See, they my... That's they, what I'm up. saying. That's why you say it like that. Cause, but why you, cause that's why you most, probably say most, end up. You don't even pay attention to end up saying, bro. Most women and most daddies. Because she, act, she acting like the nigga. That's why most women saying, and they daddies. Most they mamas and they daddies. Teach them the the mama gonna teach you, girl. You better got them find somebody gonna take care of you, and then your daddy gonna teach you as a girl. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you better protect yourself. You know what I'm saying? Have your own shit. Got them. Make sure you. So she gonna be thinking she independent, not knowing you still gonna need a man at some point in time. Your motherfucking cartel or the root, root, your root, got them cave in. But they gonna take a man. So now we in the shit like the nigga wanna be prettier than the bit than the brow, and then the brow wanna be strong and aggressive like the dude. You feel me? It's some competition shit, bro. Two man come on with the game, bro. That shit don't even go. We went with that ain't us. Nigga nigga out their character. Motherfucker living out their mean and motherfucker out their character, bro. Ain't nobody got them happy a hunt every single fucking day of the year. You feel me? Ain't it? Motherfuckers ain't just up like that, how they act like they up. Bitch, you got bills. You ain't buy that shit cash money, bro. Yeah, you got some bills. Period. Big pretty house and all that shit. If you ain't buy it straight up, baby, man, come on, man. Mother had to keep working. And shit, man. Nigga be trying to. No, we ain't that, bro. Be who you is, my nigga. Yeah, but if be you, got, you, is, if my you nigga. got a girl and you used to let her run shit, cause I know some niggas that do let their girl You a girl run man. Shit. Yeah. See, yeah. Feminine. yeah. See, that, they call them beta men. You know what I'm saying? And then you got alpha men. You feel what I'm saying? So yeah. most girls that were like tomboys and shit like that, they gonna go towards a feminine like uh, dude who they can run over at the same time. They really don't want that motherfucker because they know, man, you ain't a real man for real. You for weak real. for real. They take that. He might have the money and all that, but she see this nigga right here. He he maintain doing his thing. You feel? But he a manly man, and she gonna go sneak and get him some of that pussy. Then he gonna put that rod up on. Then she, yeah, man, come on with the game, man. He tripping, man. Put that rod up, oh, it's going to be always, she's going to be ready to leave that nigga. She's going to be staying out late, you know what I'm saying, extra late and shit like that, man. Come on with the guy, man. Then, look, staying out too late with this bra, get what you going to end up doing. Why well, you don't fall the real good, then you don't took that motherfucker to go get something from goddamn. Trout. We ain't with no goddamn trap song, bruh. <laughs> God damn. Oh, wait. Yeah, over with, bruh. Over oh, with, bruh. Oh, she don't fuck around and move that. <laughs> I shouldn't even want this nigga to walk. Let me speak to your daddy. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't never coming around. <laughs> you see know what I'm saying? Let me speak to your motherfucking daddy, ah! goddamn. Hell yeah. But now, see, man, I'm the type of person, man, I see shit for what it is, bruh. I ain't even, motherfucker show me you a liar. I ain't got to just be... Ah, uh, towards you, I could just look. Oh, that motherfucker lying when he talking to me. You feel me? Oh, that motherfucker, I know you steal. I ain't got that. Ah, oh, bitch, you a thief, and fucking thief. Nah, I'm looking at you, nigga. I'm watching you. you. Ain't gonna steal from me. You know what I'm saying? I know he a rat. I ain't gonna hang with you. I know he a punk. I ain't gonna hang with you, but I know what you is. You yeah, feel right. Me? So I know how to handle you, niggas, accordingly. But real niggas, that's real niggas. social skill. That's, real that's, that's 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 uh sociology, nigga. Knowing yeah. how to. Deal with masses of motherfucking people, bro. You feel me? Individually, oh, man, I can make with any type of motherfucker self. Motherfuckers, I'm not. If you're yeah. weirdo to me, I'm not coming around you, bro. One thing I do know is. You know what I'm saying? I ain't scared of you, none of that shit. So, people hang with that guy. I mean, like, you scared of some shit. I ain't scared of them, but, like, that boy is this. God is some bad pussy. You know people hang with that. It's something this trap soft, man. Too much, too much ism in the drip, man. You gotta, don't slip on the drip, baby. Not slip on the drip. It's on this good chicken dip. You put this shit on everything. Collard green. I put them on my tater chip. Got down my turkey sandwich. Man, I'm talking about for real. She hen for real, bro. <laughs> Dead ass here, bro. I don't promote shit. I ain't that type of person. Like, if it ain't look too legit to quit, that ain't it. Not with the tizzle man. Say what? Shit, man. You got them going that on. Um, Trapsawforsale.com and get you some of this trout sauce, but we got 
We got the small and the bigger, bigger part of it. Man, all right, tell them that part sent yeah. you down there. You're going to get a discount. Yeah, that part, podcast sent you, man. You get, get you a discount. You tell them that part, podcast that part. sent you. That part, D A T P A R D. Podcast sent you, and you'll get that you a part. discount, man. We tell when sure. we were down, so they sell, they sell a, 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 a K song. They got man, we got half a gallon, gallon man. We 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 sell them traps out like the liquor store, man. You understand me? Trapsauceforsale.com. Trapsauceforsale.com, baby. That part. That part. Trap sauce, the best damn sauce ever. Okay, then. Rich people hang with rich people, and yeah. poor people. See, that's what I'm talking about. That part, yeah. of life. I'm not on. I don't care about your car. I don't care about how pretty your house is. I'm talking about. What the fuck can we do to get out this state of mind where well, our motherfucking children won't be hating one another, not knowing they might be your cousin you beefing with, nigga? You feel what I'm saying? And you don't realize until you hit the funeral. You know what I mean? Two more like, damn, this who? Sean. You, you feel what I'm saying? So we, we do funeral reunion you now. We don't do family reunion. That shit, oh, you feel me, nigga, goddamn, motherfucker be fake for a couple hours by six, by six, seven hours, goddamn, dance and shit, eat some fried chicken and motherfucking bullshit, t uh, tater salad and shit, and then go on about their business, and you really not, they, it really not family, cause motherfucker, everybody don't want to be the man, just cause the bride want to be cheap, man, this shit weird, man, we want to, we too much into the TV, into, instead of our grandma and them, the great auntie and them, the great uncles and shit, right. but them folks, these motherfuckers don't even know how to plant a goddamn garden, bro. They go into the grocery store. The grocery store closed down. It's all with You bitches gonna die. I'm not gonna die. You know what I'm saying? I got the best of all world, baby. You feel? I know how to just in the so city. So you saying these motherfuckers know how to uh, survive like how our grandma and stuff did back in the day? They didn't want to learn it. Cause, yo, they didn't want to learn it. And then, then the men and the women now teaching the children that they, they partners. Nigga, me and my dad went cool. You feel me? I knew yeah. my dad went playing. When he said some shit, oh, did what the fuck is. I knew my mom went playing. Yeah. My mom ain't had to say some shit to me to sell my eight motherfucking time. Nigga, after that first time she said something, that second time, you damn near on your head. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Like, it piss at, it's piss tivity. You feel what I'm saying? It piss tivity. Them kind of, but then it make you say, oh, uh, listen, I guess what you, most of the thing that can happen is, though, is you say, shit, I can't wait till I get old and move out. So I can be out on my own. So I can call my own shot. You know. Cause I, I knew I couldn't wait to See, I that's a hard head motherfucker. And I don't understand how nigga when nigga, when did your nigga start doing that? Cause I remember my grandma and auntie them and my uncle and my bullshit ass cousin or something just stayed here and everybody stayed and saying how motherfucker work and help pay the bills and everybody was saving their money over the year and they got their own little family and shit. They were called extended family. They what niggas did like the Mexican do. Like the Jew, like the Jewish people do. Nigga, you Jewish, they don't give a damn what state you in. Nigga, them folk gonna help you. Now motherfucker, oh, you ain't got shit then you looking at this person cause they ain't got what, a car or some shit you got. You looking at them like they ain't really nothing. You feel what I'm saying? We all were some. Oh boy, definitely. Everybody were some, you feel me? But it's a motherfucker that really ain't shit too at the same time. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. But listen. Motherfucker worse than this. Nigga living nigga wanna be like them them hikers. Remember what I'm saying though. Yo, nigga wanna be like I couldn't nigga. wait to Everybody wanna be nigga except nigga. I couldn't wait to call my own shot. <laughs> you know but what at is. the same time, I still go back to headquarters to like Mall Deuce and, and from my house and all that. I still go and, and, and check in and on. Uh, Go eat something to them. Yeah, hell yeah. See, my grandma, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I'm like, my grandma that raised me, she gone. You feel like my mom do them folk gone. You feel me? But I got cousin. I'm down here in Mont Monticello. <laughs> I got cousins and aunties and shit like that. Right. They get something to eat. You know what I'm saying? Right. I ain't got to go raw. Nobody to get nothing to eat. I ain't got to sleep outside if I'm fucked up and broke and whatever. You feel me? That right. The folk they ain't going to handle your goddamn... Yo, habits and shit, nigga. I ain't paying for you goddamn habits and shit like that. But nigga, give you something to eat. And, you know, see, everybody want to be city. Don't nobody want to be country no more. It, you like all oh, country. Man, you crazy. Country nigga, the smartest niggas on the earth. They nigga know how to change the tie. They know how to fix a roof. They know how to goddamn plant a garden. They know how to hunt. They know how to fish. 
Man, what the fuck do you know, niggas know how to do? No skills. You talking about you gangster. Man, oh, that's they want to do is... Your ass go on the yeah. chain gang, getting a number. What you they want to do is... They ain't no more doing What they want to do in the city is... They want to be smart enough to pay everybody to do all that shit you just see. Man, listen here, man. That's Nigga want to be fly guys, man. Yeah. See, you <laughs> want to be have you, attention you like a brow. Yeah. See, when you a player, the attention come to you anyway. Motherfucker just attracted to you. You can walk in the, in the room, motherfucker, look like, damn, who that motherfucker here? You know what I'm saying? When it, 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 you, man, you can put on a goddamn Versace suit. Motherfucker won't know who it is, know what it is, but you don't look like no Versace type nigga. You feel like I put on a suit, it might not even be Versace. But they'll think it's a Versace suit, nigga. It, that shit got to be, it got to come with you. When you took your first fucking breath in life, you say, and then your whole personality growing up and shit, yeah, man, she gotta be out. These niggas trying to buy. These niggas trying to buy ism. They trying to buy gang. You know what I'm saying? Like you had to study your people that were player. You nigga didn't want it. You nigga don't want to pay attention to that. Well, if it ain't I didn't hear you ain't pay attention to if school. It ain't you get out of school and scam and no computer to the goddamn team. Nigga, you just could have went to school, you. got a degree, and came back and taught the neighborhood how to fucking handle computers and shit. You feel me? Now you nigga know how to do all that shit, man. You need to know how to scam motherfuckers on the internet and all that shit, bro. But a motherfucker won't do nothing to help the community. You just looking good, man. Fuck all that shit, nigga. You feel me? Fuck all that shit. I see how certain niggas that be flashing and what happened to them. A nigga like, bro, nigga don't really want to do it to you, but why your ass got down? You ain't got down. You flat, nigga. You come around. You come around every time, you flashy, flashy, flashy. We know you rich. You know what I mean? You ain't say he's so going to the little children. That kind of shit, uh, uh, I got a, a, a non-profit organization where the children can come get something to eat if they're hungry. Or, you know what I'm saying? Like, we ain't thinking about none of that type of shit. Everybody want to go on trips. They want to have a big ass house with nine oh, rooms. Well, you got to know it maintenance on the house now. You got a house with nine, ten rooms in it. Oh, yeah, it costs. That's two by two hundred thousand to fit keep that house up to keep a year with that nine bedroom house. Everybody want their fairy tale that got that wizard of hard dumb. So what you are saying is John going around buying up all these houses and shit ain't did nothing in the community for nobody. Yeah. But see he'll be in the man. But ain't nobody listen. listen if he buying up the community listen, then get get listen, out some hamburger hot listen, dog, nigga. Listen, bro. He ain't coming to take it. Or something. He ain't come take it. Yeah, but he got yeah. so he, he the hugger boy came and took it. Yeah, but he could do something. And then then the hugger ain't the one who sold it to him. Yeah, but he he you know what I'm saying. And he ain't wrong for having the money. We the one made gave we we you feel me? Yeah, yeah. but ain't that, that wrong? Business, bro, if I have a store, bro, if I have a store, y'all come to my I'll store. Fuck with Everybody you, different, bro. But well, I'm business, saying, John, you can go out there and give away some hot dogs and hamburgers for these kids in the neighborhood and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, that's the part of it. Yeah, too, that's yeah. all I'm saying. You ain't did yeah. shit for the neighborhood yet. Yeah. Yeah, but see, yeah, we support they, you. Niggas spend them. Hey, man, listen to her. I've been have a stove in a little pool room thing. Nobody really, you feel what I'm saying? Then they hate it out there with the other little builder. Then you see them motherfuckers acting crazy. Never see them motherfuckers acting crazy. You know what I'm saying? So, shit, bro, man. We, and we ain't going to no city council meeting. Yeah. We just talking in the fucking neighborhood like, oh, but them folks doing this and they ain't gonna let her do this. And yeah. Man, what the fuck they don't ask up when they do some shit? What the yeah. fuck we gotta ask for? You feel me? Like, yeah. man, come on, man. Who the fuck got bullied by somebody that was size a nigga in elementary school or high school? Ain't nobody else bullying me growing up, but a nigga will try to bully me. I don't like Or bullies. take something from me. Or you feel what I'm saying? Like, man, I'm, we nigga it. don't love their own self, bro. And they family, bro. Ain't no love, motherfucker. Grew up. Hey, you look ugly. Bring your little ugly ass over here. Sit your little ugly ass up down before I punch you, little black bastard. Or you look ugly, little. Looking like your motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Like, man, everything is, 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 uh, hate, 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 hate. hate. Look on, well, you, I don't post the shit like the rights of the indigenous people. The, the uh, executive order Obama passed from 2012. Motherfuckers, like, you think a motherfucker paid it to that scroll rat paid it, not even knowing this should have helped you in your real life. You feel what I'm saying? Like, you claiming to be something that somebody else told you you were, bro. Like, we just some fucking followers, man. We waiting on goddamn the sky to open and Jesus to come back down and kill off all the people that look just like him. You know what I'm saying? Because you Google it, it looked just, man, come on, man. Them folks ain't even doing that nothing now. We doing it to ourselves. 
Yeah, folks ain't been studying right. us in. No folks I already put the shit in implemented, nigga. They ain't studying us. They ain't been studying us in 30 years. Hey, you know the feds in town. Yeah. Oh, yeah, they ain't. About, yeah, about, I the, uh, about the PPP. I just told you. I just told you. They been in town, man. Man, y'all yeah, be careful, man. Those of y'all who participated yeah, in that yeah. uh, type of See, a motherfucker yeah. like me. But uh, the PPP. We had the PPP. Yeah. But see, that I mean, people, people pursue them. Get paid, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I ain't knocking it, cause I'm it. just saying we got to teach motherfuckers how to do shit. That right. way we gonna yeah. have to take shit from I one know. another, do yeah. yeah. one another. I ain't wanna like, play with myself. Like you got that, two you know type of saying? people, bro. Home, man. The two, you got. I'm gonna give a scenario of two people. You know what I'm saying? And ain't no particular people. I'm just saying. Okay, you got two two people. One went out, learned some shit, and stayed gone, and so called successful. And then come back every now and then and pop up and hey, how everybody doing? And the people say, oh, he's so, he's a settler. And then one, one of the, one was already in the midst. And then he leave and go learn something and then come back and try to teach it. And people are like, man, you think you know everything. These two type of people, they both went and learned the same thing. One of them never come back. And one came back and said, yo. Man, this is what it is, bro. Like, I don't learn the shit for everybody else to know the shit. Then y'all don't even want to know the shit. You like, what you got? What you, you know what I'm, you know what I'm saying? Like, no, this ain't that. This is for what we supposed to be here for our fucking freedom. Because you're not free. Paperwork, nigga. Your ass all caps. Period. You get your license, your goddamn ID, your motherfucking check, your bill. This shit bigger than me, no problem, nigga. Niggas out here talking about some goddamn, goddamn, oh, I went on a trip for six, man, so fucking with it. So fucking with it, bro. Don't fucking man. come in and take your shit, period. Man, these niggas. They're like that. I couldn't see though. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, y'all. They lock you up for anything. They can say, well, you ain't paid taxes in two years. Do what I'm saying, y'all. If you get a PPP, you gotta get taxed. Do what you do you with your money saying? and goddamn, just be prepared, like, <clears throat> if it is some beef with these folks, They'll be prepared to pay for it. Pay the money back if you got the shit. You know what I'm saying? There's no motherfuckers who got the money just went out and bought rams and cars. Did all that ain't my shit with the money. That I don't give a damn what they did. My main thing is, did, 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 did they go out with somebody else in on some shit and get some shit that residual so they can keep making some money or be able to help them? You know what I just said. You know what I'm saying? I just like, said that. Nigga, nigga forgot about Martin Luther King and Malcolm X. Martin Luther King wasn't doing shit for himself, nigga. That nigga was doing shit for people. Malcolm X was doing shit for people. You know what I'm saying? Oh, like like, them type of people. You know what I'm Martin saying? Martin Luther like, King was fucking these hoes. Martin Luther King was fucking these hoes. Jeff Ford. Man, don't we all fucking hoes, nigga. What the hell yeah. are you talking about? Nigga, yeah, we nigga, been fucking. Matter, man, I ain't gonna stop fucking. But listen, I'm gonna get me some pussy until them motherfuckers stop working. My old school, the old nigga told me, boy, you better use that bitch until it don't work no more. Man, you better use that bitch until it don't work no more. Man, you better use that bitch until it don't work no more. You better use that bitch until it don't work no more. Man, that's how they try to kill our character. For fucking what God said, nigga, replenish the earth. You, nigga, you, you can't down me because yo, you, you ain't got no strong genes or strong fortitude or te testicular fortitude to make no baby. You know what I'm saying? I might well, you be saying strong. It's okay for a nigga to be a preacher and then go out as soon as he get finished, he closes his church though for him to go be a, a regular nigga again. Okay, so now a preacher, what it is? A title, right? But what he is for? He was a preacher when he was nine years old. When he was 15 years old, when he was 20 years old before he started preaching, because most preachers were pimp. What you said was, you feel before he started preaching, was a pimp or a hustler or Everything you saying before he started preaching. I want to hear. What I'm getting to is he a human fucking being. You got to always, no, he a, he a being. You got to always go back to Let's start from the day he was a preacher to the end, nigga. Let's not talk about what he did that day before he was a preacher. He, he, so that don't matter. Nah, he want no oh, preacher. Okay, so where they really, so where do oh, matter is though he a preacher now. See y'all looking at him at a preacher. I'm looking at him who he is. Damn, what the trying to talk to you, nigga? I know nigga that that boy nah, and shit. You know what? You know what job. I know nigga that there's a man. Come on, man. I'm looking at who this nigga yeah. is. When okay, just say for instance, oh uh, bro, listen to him. Say for instance, if you run for something or some, something like that, or you start dealing with a certain group of people. They gonna get you around to try to find your vices out. They gonna be looking at you like, do you drink? 
then you're gonna say, yeah man, I get a shot. Then they're gonna see how you act when you drink, then they're gonna let that little one, they're gonna see how you look at the female, you looking at their ass, or you looking at their face. Chill. And then they got you. you know, Everybody know that you once you claim that, bro. a certain title, you supposed to behave a certain way. Nigga, let's not be stupid. Let's I not say stupid, that, bro. Let, hold on, hold on. Do what I'm saying. Man. You I'm can't tell to be me. Certain way, but hold on. Motherfucker don't got you can't brain, tell me right. a damn brain surgeon. I ain't expected to perform brain surgery. Yeah, more definitely. So you can't tell me better a goddamn a goddamn rapper don't supposed to perform and you show. See, my thing is. I ain't, I don't worship no goddamn preacher. I worship my grandma and granddad and them and my cousin. I'm just, I'm no, just sad, bro. I ain't listening to them. What I'm saying here, because I, yeah, man, this we is talking about where his title is, where he's supposed to do it, <coughs> how he's supposed and to him. say. Whoever well, follow him, that's your perspective. I ain't knocking what you claim or none of that. that Nigga, you not follow my, him? They're not who following the preacher. You just said Martin Luther King did this for the people. I ain't went by with Martin Luther King. I just said what he did. What did he do? <laughs> he, he was for the, for some a group of people. You feel me? I don't know what he did when he was behind the closed door with them four had that bankroll in front of him. Right. He just said he was fucking. Yeah. I, I went down, so I don't know what the fuck he do. I just know. Shit. One he, thing I do know he, is. He, he, he took, his life got took because of shit he was doing for some niggas who don't even care. If you got a child, if you got a kid by your Man, wife, you got, got an outside got too. took by some niggas that he was with. He had me Because he was running them motherfucking mouth. You, you, got, you got kids by your wife, you got kids by your side. Who killed the two? Who got who got one of them? Obviously, been fucked. A nigga. Who helped, who helped the Indian lose their land? A nigga. You feel me? Not a nigga, a, a Negro, a black. You feel me? That who helped them. That who, it went up, man. Listen, our antennas I always be up for people who don't look like us, just like they'll be up when we come around. We're not going to be, we're not going to act like we don't understand what's really going on. See, people just want shit to be. That way. Like, yeah. Man, I don't feel like it's supposed to be. Yeah, everybody ain't that feeling. Turner. Fuck your feeling. Your everybody ain't got that Martin Luther King. B, C, C, everybody ain't got that way. You know what I'm saying? Everybody ain't got that way. Motherfucker trying to figure motherfuckers out. Man, you think I meet this motherfucker? I don't be asking all them goddamn questions. I get around you and see how you react and interact and shit. Now I know how to handle you. Nigga, I don't want to. I ain't finna ask you. Bitch, how many niggas you don't fuck? What age you start fucking at? That ain't my prerogative. Bitches, you clean? Do you got some tissue in the bathroom? Do you got some soap? How you treat them children? Do you give the children some attention? You feel what I'm saying? Because when you, it's hard to meet a brother that got no children. Just like it's hard for them to meet up without no children. Nigga, you fought with no children, but woo. I don't know what to say, nigga. But I'm sure. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure you better, you better start going down down exercise doing some squats and shit, nigga. I'm sure. You got to make a baby now. Listen. Fuck what they said. Nigga, my great granddaddy had 16 children, nigga. On one side of my earth had well. On the other side, it just well, about yeah. I ain't finna yeah. meet up broad and I think I gotta answer them goddamn questions. Yeah, man, I ain't even man, I ain't even. If I think I gotta answer them questions, all them goddamn questions. You can't determine who I am by where I work. I think it's how many children I got. <laughs> nah, no, I think I gotta yeah. add this bitch and she got some tissue and all that kind of shit. It definitely no, I'm just saying, just having it. Not you ain't got you don't pull the answer. You look and say, damn. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm know, man, that being nosy, bro. Nah, that man, that, man, look, that ain't big. That man that ain't my big. Class of bro that you I'll raise it, man. My damn big. Man, know this, bro. Yeah, yeah, you should sure. look out for folk. If you can do it, you look out for folk. You feel me? And then they come back to you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I don't been in the trenches. You know it. I don't been in the trenches. Like, you have too. All over this motherfucking land that we. That we were born on. Yeah, but you supposed to know that. So. Yeah, but you you're supposed to know that if you fuck with it, bro, man, you supposed to know that. Oh yeah, this bro got plenty of paper towel, tissue, and nah, all. You know this shit. But this you don't know that when you meet her in the club. This. How you know that when you meet her at Wild or uh, uh, at McDonald's or at, at uh, Benny Hunter's? Or, you don't know that. A receipt fell out of her purse. Yeah, you don't know that. What a person do, man? These people that when they come outside, they be fresh every day, but. Nasty than a motherfucker. You feel what I'm saying? Like for real, bro. I ain't even, that ain't mean my pride. I got got them children to worry about some, some goals and shit that said it, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to do it ain't for me and worry about the children. Attention to the children. I'm gonna keep preaching that to y'all motherfuckers. You gotta pay attention to the children now while they wildin' for motherfucker right now. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, but all it ain't the children's fault, it's our motherfuckers' fault. 
All I'm saying is, nigga, it's your mom's fault, your dad's fault. I can look at some bro. I can have a Katrina around here in the world and point them out and say, oh, I know she got tissue and paper towel. Man, it yeah. might not have none. It you don't know that if you ain't like been in right there. Here now. Oh, 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 she got tissue. Okay. Oh, she's if you ain't been out of the house. And, and listen, it, it I'm ain't no way for you to know it. But listen, I can damn near yeah. look at the female no, around here yeah. and say, look. See, now you're talking they, in perspective. They, they, like, oh, man, I, I know she's straight, look, man. Oh, boy, that bitch barely making it right there. She might not have no goddamn paper towel. She might got two rolls of tissue to her goddamn night. Period. Big got one tube to pay. She ain't got no extra two brushes for company who ever come over and spend a night because that ain't the type of shit they do. That ain't the type of bitches these is. You know what I'm saying? You know how a motherfucker come to my house and stay. I got extra goddamn two breasts. I got two pages that ain't even open. Where you get that from? Huh? Where you get that from? Where I get that from? That perspective of your life of having, making sure you have some tissues and two pages. Who taught you that? What you mean? My Wait. damn mama. Oh, shit. Back to what I said, nigga. If we got to keep the goddamn children, nigga. Back the way, it always go back to what I said, when we every time, and then I always go back, because I think I know everything hey, that people say. When I spit it out on my uncles and shit, yeah, I don't make, I don't make no nonsense. I always make sense what I said now. When I spit it out in my uncle them house, my uncle them bust up with a brand new tube bread for me. They, they where they, they learn that from? And then get with it. Where your uncle get that from? But that means they got to be your grandma's son. They say, listen, make sure you go ahead and on, when I was little, you know what they used to say? Wash your baby, wash your hand before you come in and get you something to eat. Go fish you something to eat. Pay attention to the church. Listen, go in there, make sure you brush your teeth, wash your face, and your hands, and come on in there and get you something to eat. And I ain't perfect. You feel me? I tell you, I got, oh man, shit, I was a fucking nigga, man. I got two bottles of goddamn cotch, man. You know what I'm saying? They just went in when I try to give them some attention. Well, that's what I was saying. Uh, me and they more got a different I can point at these motherfuckers and tell you who probably got one roll of tissue and same, shit to their name. I'm telling you. Who probably straight hey, in their goddamn house. You know what I'm saying? Them motherfuckers got plenty of goddamn shit. The only one I see. These motherfuckers ain't changing their bed sheets every so often. I bet you. I can point at these motherfuckers and tell who probably who got about it? two sets of sheets. Who taught them that? You know what I'm saying? Who taught them that? You know what I'm saying? These motherfuckers ain't watching their clothes that from? and shit like that, how they pulled to. You know what I'm saying? Man. You can ask these motherfuckers. And, 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 you know the strong. You don't hurt me hard. You say, listen, how often do you change your bed sheet? See, that being nosy, bro. No! Look at that that ain't being nosy. That's a hygiene issue. You going to spend a night with that bitch out in the club, yeah. nigga. You don't even know that bitch don't change a sheet. You don't know that bitch ain't changed a motherfucker in two months or what. Right. You know well, what I'm saying? You look at them and be like, oh, boy. Huh? Yeah, and then you can you can try. You well, had to go see. That's a problem. Hell no, fuck that man, don't give a damn. You been you crazy here? Look, that's a problem, 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 bro. Cause if stop. you said something to the bride, then they're like, like oh, oh, nigga, you what you mean? You feel me? So now that's a whole different. You gonna slay them? You feel me? I ain't gonna put your leg on for the bit of. You you kill. If it be a pretty red ball, pretty feet. Oh, no, nah, oh, that's crazy, man. You don't know what I'm You finna die in the head for it. You finna die in the head for it. You finna die in the head for it. Man, I, man I, my dad don't let me fuck in the house as a kid, nigga. What the hell you talking about? I was spoiled growing up. Nigga, I, I'm used to pussy. Why you fucking I'm falling in love. Why you fucking in love? It's easy. Though? You had to show me. Where you fucking in the house? In the house, where though? Oh, uh, uh, yo. Yeah. I know, uh, uh, yeah. I'm talking about my way. In your room. Yeah. In the bed. Yeah, more death. Yeah, more death. Shit. Man, you know, man, you know you can add uh, Zonk, he, he gonna tell you, hey, you talking about that? You I'm fucking in the I'll join you. Hey, you talking about that? You fucking in the living room on the sofa. Man, it, man, if I had a, a bed, <laughs> I grew up in a bed, y'all. I woke up, every morning, my grandma said, Key, uh, get up. I said, all right. You know, you ain't gonna wake up on the first get up or the second one, the third one, the fourth chain. You get up, the, yeah, clothes are already ready, you know what I'm saying? Get up, got down. I already took a bath while I went to bed, bring my teeth and shit. You feel me? Get right. Put them little cologne on and shit. Put them collar shirt, their eyes are on, or they got down and little collar shirt. Put them outside. And those stash smells. The with the house. khakis on, you feel me? Ain't nobody to tell them, man. Yeah, I'm the hell of a house. I'm the hell of a house. You feel me? Yo, I, always, I got it, so I don't have to just be acting like I'm just a man or, you know what I'm saying? I'm tough, so I don't have to act like I'm the toughest or none of that. It got to be in you. And I got attention from my parents. That's what I'm telling you. I got attention from my parents. 
That's what I'm, all the main thing I've been saying, giving attention to our children. Nigga, you learn a lot of when shit. When y'all get old, nigga. You learn a lot of shit from Terry. You learn some shit from There was an elder. There was somebody that was older than me. I learned. Well, yeah, because you watched attention. They gave me what attention. they were doing. Yeah, who taught Terry? Look, somebody, right? He was raised in the same family I was raised in. Yeah. Okay. And, and I'm telling you, I was raised with love. I think everybody said, we love you. That make a difference, bro. Motherfucker ain't had to give you shit. You feel me? Motherfucker just, just that. That's a spirit. That's a breath of energy when you say it. Like, when you can, a motherfucker, you can tell a bro, I love you, baby. And you don't fuck the shit out of the seventh time. And goddamn, she really like you for real. But look, and she said, Give it all my God. I love this nigga here. And give you everything in the world. Look, you feel me? Come on, man. Let me tell you this. Do what I was trying to tell you earlier. This is the same shit. You now you, you finna you 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 agree with me and you don't know you have. But listen, let me tell you this. <laughs> my whole by Tam. That's my player partner. Yeah, long live my cousin, yeah. nigga. That nigga was a slick. Sneaky. Why you tell me that? Time out, man. Yeah. That's my brother, man. Yeah, yeah, God damn. You know, you know he got an ear down right here, bro. They go okay, get it. But listen, a lot of shit oh, that, a yeah, lot of shit, that, a lot of shit that he did, you doing that shit. shit. You do the exact shit. What you mean? You do the exact <laughs> same thing. The exact same shit that you seen. Man, I went around Terrence all the time, man. But I you do that. some of the shit. You shit. Yeah. know what you say, yeah. you, what you learn. That's a certain role, like, like, like my nigga. He like my big brother. You yeah, but that, that what you say. Learn behavior. That's when, all I was he, saying. He gave me some once business. you see a nigga do something. ain't got no fucked up reputation. But listen, once you see a nigga do <laughs> you know something, and he's successful at it, you say, oh, shit, I want to do that, too. Yeah, if it don't hurt nobody. Well, yeah, hurt, uh, okay. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, but so then you a follower. Oh! Learn behavior, nigga. <laughs> oh. to be a follower. Y'all, let's find out that nigga. Hold on, hold on. Let me find out that nigga a follower. Your family. <laughs> that nigga doing the same shit you to go to that. Nigga What I'm do. saying is the attention. <laughs> I said attention. Giving children yeah. attention. He was my big cousin. Nigga, that family. Point, man. We he gave me some of what? Attention. We do it. Come on, we They're riding the bike together. You feel what I'm saying? So. That that would make a that why a motherfucker have a coach that they look up to. Oh, that coach sudden said my daddy went down coach sudden said looked out for me and I love that nigga forever. Nigga fuck with him out, blow the brains out. You feel me? It was somebody everything learn behavior. Nigga, we got them beans, nigga. Yeah. What do you call Cause we about? see what we like. Even and then we say they damn listen. purpose. How to be? So, it nigga. only seen what you like. And then you Who wanna do it. Sell some shit. Nigga, let me tell you something. You ain't never goddamn just put your heart into some why shit. Your you ain't mind, interested why in. Why your mom or your cousin them wanna talk to you to goddamn stand up and pee you to be still pissing sitting down, nigga? You talking about everybody sat on How the much you say shit that you ain't you know interested in? How, How much you get taught? Nigga said, go pee. I gotta pee, daddy. But you better pull your dick out right over there by that tree and pee. You feel me? And then you pull out, oh shit, I can pee standing up. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they gotta stand over and hold your dick for you. It just they learn behavior. Home time now. Cole, go over there and got them. Wait, hey, cool, I gotta pee. Man, you better go over there behind that tree, nigga, and pee. You ain't no girl. They gonna hit you with that. You ain't no girl. You ain't gotta sit down and squat, nigga. Fuck wrong too. But learn what, behavior. What we gotta learn. You feel me? Yeah. I, I hey man, I learned from a nigga that was somebody. So what if you? <laughs> so what if you so with I, your I son? That. What if you with your son and your dog? What you mean? And your daughter see him go stand up and pee by that tree. What does she think she can go do it too? With uh, nature will show her she can't do that because run out of motherfucking leg. So learn behavior <laughs> then. She'll learn something. <laughs> yeah, she'll learn something. <laughs> pee down your leg, goddamn. And then run in your socks and your sock be goddamn mushy. <laughs> oh, daddy, I peed on myself. What, you you squatted or you, you stood up? I stood up. Well, shit, we'll, I'll get you right when we get to the hop. You know, you'll learn from that one. Are you a fool with it? Nah, for real. You learn from that one, goddamn. Oh, my mama ain't play. Period. Oh, okay. long live my mama. But my mama ain't play, bro. Like, boy, your ass, boy, I wash the dishes. Fine, yeah, you know, about all that. Yeah, you talking about? Nigga, step, put your ass in there, got them chill. Put your ass in there, chill. Why them bitch? Then you got they gotta be speaking Spanish, nigga. She looking at the light like this on your ass, but then they ain't right. But you been on went to sleep. Oh, boy, I'm good. Then. Wake hey, your ass up with that light. Then you say. Ah! Eventually, though, we're gonna touch bases on how old you should be 
When you start wearing them mini skirts and body dresses and thinking you fine and all of that. Kind As of a grandmama. Like if you're a grandmama, what age is, is the right age to stop wearing mini skirts and, and twerking? And doing all of that. Yeah. That's a bad motherfucker right now. Alright, before we close this out, let me ask y'all a question. Your playlist and your Bluetooth come on right now. What song I'm playing? See, say right now, probably some slow now on okay. my shit. Matt, what about you? Probably if I turn mine on right now and Matt play, probably some little wine. Close them out. Oh yeah, goddamn. All out my, my message to everybody here, because I ain't perfect, I ain't none of them perfect, man. Goddamn food, shelter, clothes, getting the children some attention, man. Your motherfucking business, man. Niggas will be okay, man. You we won't have to kill each other, man. Get right. something to eat, somewhere to sleep, so she can you let your folks stay at your house and shit. That no, you ain't gotta give them no money, you ain't gotta goddamn you feel me? Like, let them get something to eat and somewhere to sleep. That's the bad necessity. You feel me? And they get their own clothes, they grown and shit. You know what I mean? Pay the children some motherfucking attention and goddamn mind your motherfucking business, man. Quit worrying about everybody that motherfucking business, man. That ain't your fucking business. That's I don't strong. give a damn how much you call for your mortgage. That's strong. They're not my business, man. Stay the fuck out of nigga. Yeah, if it ain't helping us together as a whole, cause we fucked up right now. And how we going, we're gonna be fucked by listening up by them folk. Put our ass back in the goddamn indentured servitude. You know what I'm saying? Look, that word indentured servitude. You feel me? It ain't working for goddamn free. Yeah. That you word, feel me? Y'all niggas see me fucked up, man. Help help fuck me, your man. car. Help you talking about me and shit, Fuck man. your house, nigga. Motherfucker, take that shit. Help y'all, nigga, man. Pull up on the nigga, man. Yeah. I might fix some shit out with y'all, man. Come on. That part. That part. That part. That part. That part.